This morning, one new season, one new cast, one big announcement. The suspense is killing me. The Dancing with the Stars rumors will be put to rest. The new cast revealed live this morning on Good Morning America. Hello to our fans online. I'm John Muller. And I'm Diana Perez. Here are some of the top stories on this Wednesday, September 4th. Convicted rapist and kidnapper Ariel Castro has killed himself in state prison. Castro was found hanging in his Ohio prison cell around 9 o'clock last night. He died later at the hospital. Castro was sentenced last month to life in prison, plus 1,000 years for kidnapping and sexually assaulting Amanda Berry, Gina De Jesus, and Michelle Knight. He had blamed a sex addiction. A Senate committee today set to consider authorizing military force in Syria if approved. It would be a major victory for President Obama as he prepares to build international support. But any commitment of ground forces would be ruled out. The resolution would also narrow the time from about 90 days or less. Top-ranked Serena Williams has moved into the semifinals of the U.S. Open. She made quick work of her opponent from Spain last night. The entire match took just 52 minutes, the first set taking just 19 minutes, during which Williams did not lose a single game. After the match, Williams said she likes to believe there's still room for improvement in her game. I find that hard That'd to That'd be believe. scary. <laughs> Speaking of room for improvement, check out this amazing video, time-lapse video diary there of a woman who reached her goal of losing weight, dropping 88 pounds in just one year. She gives all that credit to her sticking to a high fat, low carb diet. In fact, she says she virtually did no intentional exercise. She said all those pounds by changing her diet. That is an incredible, an incredible story. video. And you know what? Her story is really great because all she says you have to do, and, and some things work for some people, some things don't. She says all you have to do is set yourself one goal per day. So if you think you can do 200 or 20 push-ups today, that's your goal. If you think you can keep your calorie, your calorie count to 1,400 or less for today, that's your goal. You don't have the same goal every day. You just have a good goal every day. Can't argue with that. There you can't go. argue with that video, right? No. Get more news anytime at abcnews.com. I'm John Muller. And I'm Diana Perez. Thanks for watching. This is World News Now, available anytime, anywhere you want it. Every day, more Americans choose ABC News, America's number one news source.